back to Glitz Assassin's Such Light Tutorials. Hope you all have a fabulous Friday. And I'm so excited to be back with you. And today is the first day of the December subscription box. Thanks. Hey, Mika. Thanks so much for tuning in. So we are just gonna be is unboxing the subscription box and I'm gonna using the uh, the items in the box. And we're gonna do some uh, really quick, simple and easy nail art. Hey everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. So we're gonna give it just a couple minutes. Hope you all have a fabulous Friday. If you are working, hope you have a really productive days and a busy days and fabulous day. All right, so let's get right in. Hey, thanks so much, uh, Venus Nails. Hello, how are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. Hi, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Hello, Della from YouTube. Thanks so much for tuning in. And... And thanks so much for all of you from a different platform. And also thank you to the uh, TikTok fans as well. Hey, hey, Dom. Thanks so much for tuning in. Happy Friday. I'm so excited with the buff. You know what? Everybody will say, uh, don't unboxing, but this is great. I think it's the funnest part to being an unboxing because my box will be the same theme with your, but might be different is colors or is um i don't think it's, it's the the contents in there it's gonna be all the same thing but it's really cool that glitz love how we doing it is for you because every single of us is unique and different so that's why glitz don't want to just give everybody the same is you know like exact the same uh content but it's the same theme so then that's why we can all have fun and be our own unique way so my box it's funny that every time I see everybody unboxing, oh my God, I wish it's going to be in my box, but it's really cool because my box have a lot of, of uh, fun nail art in there. And then for a whole entire month, if I do nail art, I don't think even though that I finish all the nail art. So I'm so excited about this box and I'm excited for every single of you are receiving your box as well. So let's um, unboxing this. And it's really love about this. Um, is the mailing bubble to protect your beautiful and um beautiful boxes and you know i recycle this box everybody different if you don't want to use this you can cut it away but i think it's just great for environments that you know i am uh it just um recycle my box i put my uh my nail art supplies in there so then it's organized i'm gonna mark my box right in the corner so right here is gonna be december which is the tw the box uh number 12. so we are going to like a phone cycle right now going to the box number 12 and thank you thank you for amazing love and support we are finishing a one full years of a great a lot of a uh, passion a lot of dedication a lot of excitement and a lot of proud to every single of you for is being you for being be amazing so let's get started and i'm so excited and this box will be is not only is really good for myself that you know i got a lot of nail arts in there it's great for every single of you out there who sub for yourselves or sub it for your loved ones you can get this is really ship it to your door for anyone you would like to give you know it doesn't have to be holiday it can be any day any times throughout the year for just because you know so let's open this ah thank you so much though i know right it's just i think i don't want to read it like really aggressive because sometimes you know you can use this the papers and doing some picture if you want to so let's get right into the box i don't know if you a lot of you will say that you're going to do design with this but i don't think i need designs with this one but i'm gonna save it on the side here because i then i don't want to do it around talk it around when we're doing a live and it's always we always get a special thanks you know giving a little bit of all different color of glitters we'll have a hundred different type of glitter colors like a particle bigger smaller and different shape throughout the years for different occasion and um you can get scan it right here is go direct to ours uh, website and it's also in the back it has a crystal application guide just in case you are like you know just forget one or two steps it's always there and also you can uh, go to our social media which is on all the platform um instagram 
YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, we all have is the instructions and also a support video for every single of you. And it's just always like getting a special a thank you um, discount here. But when you are follow our brand ambassador team, they also have a really unique and special is called to give it to you and a special to you, just special thing for supporting them and they always putting out a great content so if you haven't get chance to connecting with them um their list of their social medias page is on our highlights is if you go to highlight you can see that our team you can able to meet virtual with them and follow each other i usually keep this and i mix them together or you can leave it alone it's up to you and then again, we're going to have another flower. I'm so excited because this is going to be, it doesn't matter is being holidays or anytime. You can definitely enjoy having fun with the 3D handcrafted flowers. And it's a great thing about it. I do not have to sit like an hour to create my flowers. I can absolutely like get it right hands on and um, get my flowers on. You know, in fact, that I have one, I have two. This one right here is in like have... um black and white and they still stay on like concrete on my nails so i'm so excited with this so i can do more designs for this month it's really beautiful and it's like really nice and it curl it's gonna wrap right on the nails if you if i tone it this way so every single like you will a lot of you will get this a lot of you will have like different uh flower different shape there are like uh, 30 or 40 different type of flowers and each of them are have a different color. So I'm so excited about like every single of you will get really cool flowers as well. And we're going to go back into the um, in the box again. And then we are going to get, you know, I get this lace mesh lace, which is I have a lot of videos with the mesh lace. I'm so excited because it's going to be in like have a holidays or every day. It can be a festive every day. It doesn't have to be holidays. So I'm so excited. We can do it encapsulate with a liquid and powder with the velvety gels. And also, if you are doing it with the gel polish, you can use that with the condensed blue gel as well. It's had a lot for each time you're going to use, you're not using a whole piece of it. And then really cool about the mess lace, you can trim them. And then using with the um, premium eye hole chant for four to give you even a better adhesions. They has a lot. So usually I cut it smaller and I cut into the smaller pieces and put in the little um, container. So then that way I have it ready to go. Or it's like, um, and you can use it, you can cut it into the part of a lot of foil or a lot of mesh. It depends on how you like it or your clients like it. So I want to do that as well. And then we have is the holiday stickers. It's really, really um uh, clear the image is so beautiful and absolutely as stunning i can't wait to have a hands on it and then remember that we're talking about this this last few videos or every time that i show you the uh sticker that i have the album stickers and um i show you this one of this one is the number 26 so you are this is the glow in the docks let me show you if it's below under the we have a lot of lights right now so you are going to get this one and glow in the docks oh the lighting you can see the re, the effects from that okay try for a second look at that is that cool still a lot of lighting but it's just so beautiful it's so stunning you know what? You can do it on the top of the gel polish. You also can do encapsulating it as well. There you go. It's really quick chalks and it's already glow. And then I put I'm gonna put it in my is um the album stickers here. So then it can hold up to 80, 80 pieces of your stickers. Really nice and neat. So I organize like holiday stickers in one category and then is um uh, like butterflies or flowers in the different categories so i love about a subscription box we always like having is um the the files uh send it on your way so that whether you are doing your enhancements or a job palace you can definitely keep it really handy 
is 100 and 180. So it's perfect for velvety gel dipping powders, liquid can powders. I have two every month. You have two. So make sure I'm going to keep it here. This is it for myself. And of course, look at what is coming in the box this month. You asked for it, and here it is. It is beautiful. It's so adorable. It's beautiful, perfect. It's one of the most the best sellings. Is colors um a glitz velvety gel. So you asked for it. It is. Hello. Thank you so much. How do I say G giant Nietzsche? Did I say it right? I hope I didn't. Gian. Gian Tonilini. Gian Tonilini. Did I say it right? If I, I say so. it wrong, then don't kill me. <laughs> I will try my best. Okay, let me get my um. Let me get my uh, tweezers. I'm gonna open this. You ask for it, it is here, it is. So you can, everybody can get a uh, really cool of a taste of Glitz Velvety Gels. And I'm going to do this. I'm going to show you how it's really easy doing Velvety Gel today. I'm so excited. You can see that how beautiful the color is. Sorry. All right, I'm going to leave it here because we are going to doing a tutorial with this nails, with this uh, Velvety Nude Colors. All right, I'm excited. Okay, put it down. Put it right on the side, so I'm gonna let you oh, There you go. So it's Jen Antolini. Jen Antolini. Uh -huh. Did I say it right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Thank you so much. And then we are moving on the phone box of the foyer again. And I'm so excited because this is theme as I seeing it on the description. The theme is gonna be for like is holiday and designer. So if you are like really in holidays, you can definitely have a lot of fun with this. And if you are in like not really, really in holidays, you can give it to your friend, your bestie, or you can send it to me, I'll take it. <laughs> it's just awesome. And then you can use the rest of them. There's a lot of uh designers fun and also along with incorporate with the boy. Oh my gosh. And then I just did this one is the other days. It's we are loving it, give it newest things and trendy is for you. So then that's where you cap everything up to date, whether you are doing it for the client or just starting with your business and it's just, you know, have a limit of your budgets for your um investing it. It's just gonna be a great, great way to get started with a lot of new art, nail art. And also the tutorials come with this and every month will be a new is a nail art ideas and nail art uh, supplies is coming to your door without have to worry about what I am going to create this coming month. So there's a 10 full box of it and I have so many. I already have an eyes on a lot of others and then I have an idea for throughout the um, months for the uh, tutorial. And guess what? I have this. I have this is baby meat jars and as a research subscriptions a uh, description is a uh, series number 11 I didn't have this one yet so I'm so excited about and a lot of you might get the one that I have um the, this one that I did it on the other days is two then a lot of you might get the clear one and then kind of a bluish iridescence I'm so excited so I have this too but I didn't have this one so I'm so excited because now I have this one I didn't have it I have only two so I'm gonna put it here so you can see how beautiful it is it definitely is great for even the holidays and, and New Year's coming. You know, there's a lot of uh, elements in there and different shape and a different size of a SS as well. So it definitely, I love it. So sparkles. And also I have this too, so I can definitely use it as well. So a lot of you will get this colors, but I got this obsidian and I'm so excited. Okay, let's put it on this side because we are going to use that as well. And moving on, the next is a lot. The list keeps going like on and on. 
I'm gonna open this so I won't like rip everything. And we are getting is uh holidays, snowflakes, exclusive mix. I don't know how close so I can show. Good. Can you see under mm -hmm. the camera? It looks beautiful. The my is like goldenish. And a lot of you will get this in a uh, different color too. It's so beautiful. I can't wait to see all your beautiful creations. So I can't wait. want to do that one as well on the nails uh, for the tutorial. And then I have uh, this encapsulate charms. Let me open this one. Uh, the tree. Let's see what I have. Oh, I just threw it away. I didn't know what number I got. But you have a two collection. It's from a collection one and collection two. So what number? I don't know what number I get. But let me see what I got here. I got like Christmas tree, snowflakes. I like it. You can definitely do with snowflakes. It's going to be like a winter theme as well. Look at the penguin. Is it penguins with the sweater? So adorable. And then what is that? Reindeer? So a lot of you will get like this. That's like so many. That total of 24 different uh, charms on the website. And then you have two out of that 24, which is awesome. I'm going to open the second one while so you hear me like uh, ripping it, all of them off. Can I get another tree? I don't know what, what number I got. I just do that trick. That's so excited. I didn't even care what number is in the charm. I might able to see it, might not. Okay, so. So let's see what I got here. Oh, and I have I have the uh, flowers here too. So I had, what is that? It's like a balloon? No, wrong. It's an ornament. <laughs> I said, wait, what is this balloon? Is it ornaments and candy cane? More snowflakes. What is that? Oh, nice. And then the gift box. Oh, there's so many. I thought it was a balloon. No, it's upside down. It was uh, ornaments. And then Christmas wreaths right there. Oh, nice. I'm so excited. It's kind of cool exciting and then also is like a fun and um challenge your creativity so i have this four bucks i'm gonna show you what i got before we get started with the tutorial thank you so much for hanging out with me for unboxing it's fun because i'm excited i know but oh my god it's a it is like i get what i want actually it's is good though i get pretty much everything i want for the holidays lace mesh and i have the gold colors gold and uh like a white mesh lace and i have the file i know you can see it's all on the screen but i'm going to try to show you oh i still this one And then here's my flowers. Do I miss anything? How many no, items? Oh, no, 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 here. I put in the tray, that's why I said, wait, I think I missed something. So let me see how many items I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And bonus is 12. So that is really good for a subscription box with a lot of, you already have, I already haven't like, um, my head's only is like spinnings with a lot of ideas for the nail art to to share with you and i'm so excited so should we continue to doing uh, some tutorials and i'm gonna using one nails with the uh, newt two nail with the newt but then also is love this collections right here just not to distract but i am distracted right now because i have an idea with this is uh kind of a newt color but um by the way there are the giveaways on the on the uh instagram 
So if you're on Facebook or is on YouTube or Twitch, just head over to Instagram. There's this really cool the post on the real post is who's named this collection. They have every single one of them have a name individual, but we'd love to to you know like have help from you to naming this collection. So may the best names win. So who's gonna select the best name and is is the most attractive name that we pick will win all completely six colors of this is collection so i have a six color right in front of me and i have the uh, swatching right on the top of the cap i absolutely you can go all the seasons all year round with this you will never go wrong with this collection so it's like of course it's like a nude colors but uh we would love to see the naming from you so how about out and get chance to win the completely six colors of this you know I don't know, they're all different names, they're not nude. So is we can't wait to see all of your naming and have fun, ladies and gentlemen, and good luck. And the winner will be announced on the November 18th. And the best name will win completely six colors of this collection. So I'm so excited. So this is right on Instagram. You can see the real post and help us out with the naming and have fun. And also is get chance to win the uh six colors like whole collection of six colors so i'm gonna move this one back into my box and we're gonna start doing some cute tutorials with the nude velvety gels i am so excited you don't know how much i'm excited about this because i got an idea for this 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 this, this. i don't know it's just so many so i can't wait okay let's get started I'm gonna put it back to my box. I'm gonna I'm gonna put the number in my box. I usually put it right on the top right there. So this is my number 12 ready. I have them stacked up. Is um you know, should I put it out here? Because I want it. Sure. Uh whatever you're gonna I, use for I'm gonna stack it here. And then so I can use this. It's my flowers. I actually it's really cool though. I love this flower, it's perfect. okay so let's get started with tutorials everybody is doing great everybody doing okay should we go ahead and do come back or do uh continue do tutorials though right, we're gonna keep going Marshall. let me know i have two uh file i'm gonna keep it right on the side so you don't see it but it's right here next to me so it won't go anywhere unless you see cameraman start taking the file and then file his own nails and his pedicure then we can hear it. So with the velvety gels, I am going to need um, the bay gels. And I dropped one or two drop right here already. And um, let me open completely because I just opened it. I'm afraid I'm going to spill it. But I'm going to open it completely. This one off. so beautiful i'm gonna get this one ah i just stuck with this one no it's okay i'm good I'm gonna use it later. I'm not gonna mess up with this now. Just, just leave it there. Yeah. Good. So I'm going to using the uh, velvety gel brush. Is one end is spatula so that I can get my gels without getting sticking anywhere else. I make a mat and then this end is the bristles that is special for velvety gel. So is really nice and um stay absolutely is a good doing the application so it's not even um the bristle not easy to coming off it just stay really nice and good quality so i'm gonna pick about like a mediums uh beat i'm closing this one and i have the nails already prepped if you are doing your nails prep it with the um with the dry manicure clean it with the manicure and also um 
Hold on. 10 seconds. And then uh, also prep it and clean with the acetone and apply the one coat of the bay gel here for 10 seconds. And then I will key in that for 10 seconds. And we are going to place the beads right on the nails and then tuck it closer to the cuticles. This is so easy. It should not be a really is difficult and hard at all i am so excited and we're gonna be just really gentle and i guide it to the free edges of the nails and the salt level of this beautiful velvety gel would do majority of work for us so you don't have to manipulating it too much okay and then we are going to wipe off this I'm gonna need that on the back. Here you go. And you can start seeing it is salt level, but it's not too fast to the point that is going to um, like run it everywhere. Then you have to chase after it. You see. I drop the um the cap. Okay. So I'm not using at the end. Just clean my um the spatula ends, and then now I'm gonna submerge my bristles with the beige gels and tuck it in. Use in the meantime, you start seeing it is absolutely south level. And when you're doing the nude color, if you want to do like a full cover snail, you definitely don't have to add the um, crystal clear, which is the velvety gel crystal clears on. You can do as right as as just solid color. Just in case you are doing it with encapsulate, you want to um, make sure you cap the crystal clears on the top of your uh, glitter. But in this nails, we're going to do a solid colors on the nails. And I'm going to do basically is keep the bristle is nice and parallel with the nails and just really gentle guide your velvety gel for to the tips of the nails, the free edges. I mean, and it's going to be is salt level at the same time you are going. So then whatever is the excess of velvety gels. You definitely can remove that. And you can see that. Let me ask you, do you have to find this off? File this on off? I guess like after you after everything. You mean the cleaning up after before you top coat it? Probably. Or is when you're removing them? Hey. So if you are Dearly, if you are doing this once and if you want to remove them off from your nails, then yes, you have to fire it off. But if you are just want to cleaning up and then to getting ready for the designs and just really like really gentle, you don't have to buff too much and aggressive with this. You can definitely just really slightly shape on the side and buff and then clean up the wrap the kitty goes really gently because this you don't have to worry about it. it's running everywhere because this is a gel and then you can able to get that you can see that it's set level but it's not running everywhere so you have a whole entire control of, of your products and your application yep so you're gonna bulk it you have to completely remove them if you want to do with the new set all right so great so now i'm gonna go ahead and cure for 60 seconds We'll move it on the side. Move to the next one. I'm gonna do, I really want to do on the top of this. Also, I wanna do encapsulate. Should I do encapsulate? I really wanna do encapsulate too. I'm gonna do another one. It's encapsulate. 
or maybe I'll just do two. So just in case you don't have a crystal clear, we can do two and then do a designs on it. How about that? And then the next one, we're going to do the, I'm going to add another one again. Get about a medium bead. It really depends on how long. If you have a shorter nails, the length of your nails, you can definitely get a little bit less amount of your beads of your velvety gels. And if you are getting yours um, longer, you can definitely um, getting a little bit like bigger beads. It really depends on the length that you are going to do. And it's so easy though. It's so easy. It's lighter when you're weighing it and also easy application and also it's really strong and flexible. All right, so I'm uh, using the bristle on the other end and start, you can start seeing it's like, um, it's self levering for you, but it's not like it's flushing and running. This is the one after it here. So I'm gonna shape that shortly. And now I'm go ahead and submerging my bristle into the bay gels. And from close to the cuticles, I'm gonna tuck it in really gentle. You don't wanna push it too hard. Like basically use like a really gentle touch. You don't have to go really aggressive. So Sarah Asher, can you use this with a form? With a form? Yes, absolutely. You can use this with a form if you are scripting it, no tips at all, absolutely. When you place a form on, you can do the exact same procedures. Yeah. And this is a quick reminder. So all this product, you can find on blitzexistence.com. And for this one in particular, it's part of our December subscription box, which is available today. So if you sub today, you will get this thing in the mail in about a couple of days. All the content. I'm so excited for everyone to give it like a cool um, tries on the uh, subscription box. You ask for it, we listen, and here is your a beautiful velvety gels on your subscription box. All right, so you can see that all the procedures I do are just basically getting not even a really aggressive, just really like a gentle and guide the velvety gels toward to the free edges of the nails. Happy with this, we are going to cure for 60 seconds. And I'm going to fire the other ones and get it ready for the designs. I move this one on the side so then it's one getting all the dust get into the nails. Thank you so much everyone for tuning in. Make sure you pinch your brush to remove all of the excess um, bay gels first. And cap on. If you need to clear it, clean it after you finish with this new set, just using the um, bay gels or the no wipe top coat, which is the no pigments gel. It will be able to release all of the gels, um, excess gels, and then keep your brushes really nice and clean. I'm going to close my velvety gels. Let me request some uh, transfer foil gel in the next box. Transfer foil gels. Mm -hmm. Well, yes. So we get to our R&D. They are the one who develop all the box for every month. And we pass your request. And if they get part something, that will be super, super nice. So I'm going to go ahead and shape.
and slightly buff it. And we're going to do the same thing with the next one. Make sure you remove all the um, tacky layer first with a 99% alcohol. doing right on the sides on the edges and buff from the center of the nails Oh, I think she asked precision glue gel. I think that's what she asked. Oh, the precision glue gel? I think last month was that. Yeah, I think we last have month it last we month. Got the precision glue gel for November box. So if you sub for the November box, you should already have one. I'm going to clean up all of the um, the residues. So we are moving on the... Um, It's really cool. There's a lot of things that I would like to do with the encapsulate and with the glitter. So I'm going to move it right on the side right here. And let's do some chanfer foil and, and uh, crystal placement. It is all so beautiful. So I'm going to get this one right on the side. That's what I got. And here's my voice box. You might have something similar. Oh my gosh, this is pretty. That's pretty. Okay, I'm gonna do this one. So Chanto Foy. What are you using premium I hold chant for voice and we're gonna do a that designs on this one and once we are going to do with the chant for four gels with the, the other designs so we're gonna cure this for 30 seconds make sure you apply it on tight the nails okay 30 seconds here. And then there's a lot of different designs I want to do with. Also, I want this one too. One of this design? Mm -hmm. Well, you can start with that. This looks pretty. I can do the other ones with this. 
another premium I hold Chan Phu Phoi. This one is done. You know, keep in mind, you can do a whole nails with this or you can do with a half nails and do is um, decoration. Oh my gosh, this one is cute too. I like that one too. So many, it's so hard to pick which one. Oh, here's it's a whole tree right there. Mm -hmm. But then the tree's like... <laughs> now it's all hard to pick which one. There's a lot of cool design on this and you can flip flop, do however you like. <laughs> I said, oh my gosh, I have a hard time now. Okay, maybe half tree then? Then I have some snowflakes on it. Okay, whatever. It's hard time now. Hey, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, we'll do this one. How about that? So many ways. Give it good pressures on. I mean, good rubs. What did I say? Good pressure? You don't have to like really aggressive. And if you like, don't wear any crystal or a little bit of crystal, this is going to be cool and fun as well. The colors, the nude color is so perfect. Oh my goodness. Everything. Yep. So if you've been using a crystal for gel, you know how really nice that is. It literally, 30 seconds later, you got the perfect pencil for every time. And even like some of the step one four that people mentioned, it worked too. So we do another one and then we can do a uh, crystal placement on it. <gasps> oh no. It has some paper pencil on it. I did. Yeah. It's upside down. Well, I think we can fix that. It's just almost like you got a really nice. I'm going back around. Go ahead, put it over and see what we got. Uh, I don't think it's going to stick, babe. It won't stick, no. But at least uh, it's a good case study. So when it happened like looking. this, don't worry. Just don't just don't listen to him because you're going to get the bell. Hey, it's a <laughs> case study, right? So we make the mistakes and you don't have to. He tried to, to convince me, like, it's okay, you can put it on. Oh, no. So when it happened like this, uh, the best thing. <laughs> I almost listened to him and put it on. I know that it's not going to work, but it won't be pretty. But hey, it's case study, right? We make the mistakes that you don't have to, and we do it live too. So <laughs> plenty of people say it, so they don't have to make a mistake. We did. No, Perfect. I would. We I know it's not going to chamfer it because it's ripped on my paper. Is what happened that it what happened. Just here's a great way. Just in case you are doing it, it happened at home or you're doing your clients or the clients accidentally touching, like especially is the winter time, they're touching on the sweaters and then their clothes and then all the furs getting there. You know that it's not going to chamfer perfect and don't make yourself really miserable by getting so upset about just wipe it up with um alcohols and apply another layer on it and keep it for 30 seconds 30 seconds rather to do over 30 seconds instead of yeah, fixing a whole mess because only chance for it on you have to fire them off or buff it off so babe good try and thanks so much for your um <laughs> most important thing well, yeah. hey. just don't freak out just stay calm do it out you good yes all right And hey, crazy Sarah, can you show how to encapsulate? Yes, on the next videos, we're going to show how to encapsulate with the uh, velvety gels. And if you can, you cannot wait. Feel free to go through our video library, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, everywhere. Tap it, encapsulate. You'll probably see a ton of videos. We do have. Uh, if you want to stay with us online, uh, we do it tomorrow. Yep, we are going to do every day. And okay, so. Is it really cool? I have it, the chanfo. I hope I didn't get it upside down <laughs> because a lot of time I say, are you ready? Are you ready? And everyone watching live and then I, nothing happened because I would did it up like the other, like upside down. Didn't like you got it right side. There you go. Yeah, reverse away. <laughs> so I'm going to give it really good rub on. It's funny. It was like, like, everybody ready? Are you ready? And remove it. 
is only not chamfer when you are not apply the um, chamfer foil gels. If you have it on, it should chamfers everything for you. I love it absolutely. Just like that. Look, yep. it's, and, uh, everything is mm -hmm. come off. Yep, just so like Nancy said, make sure you apply all over. Because sometimes, like your brush doesn't touch it, or somehow it doesn't have. So take a quick look before you apply your foil. So now, if you love it so much, you don't want to have anything else on, just go ahead and top coat it and cure for 60 seconds. Like, no wipe top coat and cure for 60 seconds, you are good to go. But if yeah. you are, like, your clients want a little bit more. Oh, my gosh, I forgot. I'm planning to show everybody doing an ombre. <laughs> oh, with the gel polish. You can still doing it. Uh, but it's going to be ombre of this. I'm like, okay, I'm going to get it. show everybody ombre. You want to see that ombre? It's really simple. You can able to do it right on the top. So mochi now no so this month's box do not come with the transfer for gel but we do come with a lot of transfer for so we are going to i'm gonna add it just like a little of the touch of um rosy glitters i love this glitter in the gels and i have also matching in the powder as well so i'm gonna just apply this really really uh thin coat about half of the nails and then I'm gonna using my palettes right here with a little of gels, bay gels there. And also, if you don't have this brush, the floral brush number one, is this okay? If you don't have this one, you can using the other ones. Is the dual end is creates so many different different type of flowers and then petals. I'm gonna using this end to create a really simple ombre. If you don't have it, you can also using the twin tip brush. Twin tip brushes work as well. Um, it's just a flat on the um, top. But this one is have a little like um, ombre effects on the brush. So I'm going to just like pick up a little bit of the uh, bay gels. And I'm just using the tip of number one. Total brush? For a brush. And just really keep it flat, like parallels from the nails. And then you just really a gentle get it up. That's that's it. That's pretty much that's all you need to do. And then now you're going to key up for 60 seconds. And then now with that nails, you can stop right there. Don't have to do anything else. Maybe should we stop there? But I want, who's like crystal or not too crystal though? You can put some nice and quick one on top. So because you have four, you have already. Gel, I have this you colors. You, a a lot, lot of you will have this colors. I love this color. You know what? One big stone on it. That's it. Why are you so it. simple? Or this. I have this. But a lot of you will get this. A lot of you will get this one. I love this. Maybe I'll stick with what I have. Uh-huh. Yep. So quick note on the on the subscription box. Why we have the theme the same. We do. Swap our park around so you always have something different, something new. So it's always exciting. So when you open, you don't know exactly what you're going to get. You know, you're going to be on theme. This is really cool, though. It's kind of a really like uh, makes my brains um, have a brainstorm. Just think of it as you have a Christmas present every month. Yeah. You know, it's a fun experience. You know, you're going to get a cool stuff. You just don't know exactly what you're going to get. So if you want your ombre to be darker, you can apply, go ahead and apply another coat and then make it even like a more ombre as you prefer. If you don't want anything else, just stop right there and good to go. And maybe I should do just a little bit of crystal around the cuticles. That's it. And I don't want to destroy the looks of that. I promise because otherwise I'm going to keep going. And everybody gonna stop me from covering everything. So I'm gonna apply the condensed blue gel. So first step from a three-step methods crystal trifecta. If you're having a hard time with the crystal placement or is trouble with this, is it keep coming off or talking about this coming off? Here's I'm gonna tell you something is really cool. Okay, give me. Let me uh, finish this and don't let me forget it. And I'm gonna tell you the comparison of my two hands. I'm I'm a, a great testimony to show you. And um, leave this right here. 
And don't forget, floating Dino Web Top Gold, which is the second step from a crystal uh, trifecta. And then I am go ahead and adding. I'm gonna get this just a smaller pieces right here. Oh my gosh, it's a little heart right there. I want this. Front door. I'm thinking about doing it in the crystal in the cuticles, but I'm gonna do it right there. That's it. And I'm gonna using the silver, this one, because it had the silver hints in the, um, or you can use a rose gold, rose gold, rose gold bead. This looks cute too, but I have a silver right here in front of me. And I'm gonna do one, oh. two. <laughs> Can't resist the urge, yeah? Huh? I thought you say no crystal. I said a little bit. But hey, it's pretty. I said three. And sir, yes, you can use my top coat over Kines Blue Gel. It's more like what kind of final look do you want? So very common, people like shiny. But yes, my top coat will work just as well. All right, awesome. So that's it. I'm going to wipe it off on the edges to make sure there are all the excess like condensed glue gels or no wipe top coats at the extra. So keep the shape really nice and precise. And that's it. We are going to cure. I'm not going to ruin the beautiful look. It looks so beautiful. Looks good. The structure is good. Okay, cure for 60 seconds. And moving on, that this one is so beautiful. I love it. I know so I want to add some more. I'm just maybe add just a little bit of a. Uh... Well, you know what? Since you already have transfer foil on, let dab some glitter on it. Make it look pretty. Oh. All shiny and pretty. Oh, maybe I can add some glitter. I can add some glitters on the chan on the uh, number twenty eight hollow glitter, or. Sky bling will be a good one too. So if you want like a lot of holo glitter, you can get just a little bit of um glitter from the uh number 28 is holo glitter silver. Holo silver, sorry. I said what holo glitter? Well it's hollow and it's glitter for sure. It also have the shape still, right? All right. Just a little bit hands don't match and key for 60 seconds. Make sure you're keying all the gels. And then I'm going to go ahead and using the condensed glue gel. I'm going to add just a couple of crystal and not, not to cover all the chance for foil. This is the first look we have. I'm using just a little bit. So now, if you know exactly what you are going to apply just on the uh, cuticle area, you are definitely going to do is right here and then floating your no wet top coat on the top when you're using the condensed glue gel. But if you are going to apply, like, you know, a lot of uh, crystals placements on and you're not sure that you're going to add it on, like sometimes my clients always want to add more after we already have the desired looks. So they want, like, can I cut a couple more? You know, it's like an SS on it. So then at least you have the um, condensed glue gels already ready for you. So you don't have to worry about putting it on and it's not going to stay. So apply this good layer of the condensed glue gel, not too thick, not too thin. Too thick is going to flood your crystal. Too thin is not going to adhere your crystal properly. So no wipe floating on the top. But now if you want to finish with the uh, matte finish or if you have the... Uh, glitz, I ho holos, silvers, or rose gold top. You can also use that as well. I'm gonna add just. I think I can find some store, huh? I thought you're gonna do glitter. No, I already have a glitter. There's a little and glitter. And like big snowflake, rainbow glitter. Huh? No, then it's no. gonna have to do another layer. Mm -hmm. So for next video, I promise. Yeah, just like you say, hey, so I have plenty of toys for you to play with. So in next one, I'm going to encapsulate it. 
and I'm gonna do encapsulate two different way. way. So I'm gonna do. You know what? I really want this one for the top of the tree. How about that? Yep, definitely. The big star on the top of the tree definitely needs some shiny. You know, that's what I have. But you can use um the color is gonna be a difference on you can put anything you would like to on. This is really cool though. It's like a trendy Christmas tree. Then we'll do one right there. I'm pick a smaller one. This is for my uh sub box. This is baby meat jars I have. I'm so excited. The obsidian is really cool. It's, it's perfect for like a New Year's as well. It's kind of a really trend though, because when you go to the store now, you're seeing like all the holiday stuff that have black and white, which is I loving it. Let's give it more variety instead of green and red, you know. You can have your pink. Yep. I guess Nancy got too much of red, green, and gold. So now she wanna decorate her tree a little bit different. Is it cool though? That's it. That's all I want. I'm gonna make sure this is wipe it off on the edges and cure for 60 seconds. All right. I'm so excited. I really appreciate it. Every single one of you are joy with me with the um, unboxing and some really quick, simple tutorials. This is absolutely is fun. Whether you're doing it for yourself or you're doing it for your clients, it's going to be a lot of products for you to play with. So I am going to get the other nails out and then we are going to the third step of the trifecta and then this is the um i still have my precision glue gels and then the new ones that i got from a subscription box still waiting for me so i'm not using this the needle there's a two end the one end is come with the it's tight though with the brush i mean so then just in case you need to using with the bigger um pieces of the uh, charms which is the big charms you can able to seal it without have to using the uh, needle and the precise end oh yeah and uh you can remind you don't forget to show them your nails oh yes so here is really cool example of my nails and this nail we remember well last week i know what day we did we did the whole entire the nails with the crystal placement and absolutely stays and i works a lot in the warehouse as well and do my works at home cleaning folding clothes and everything so this one stay but this one when i did remembers i did live and i put all my pre-season glues really detailed beep, 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 all over and then this one I did it first and I showing you and it's still still heal uh seal really really well but I didn't do a precision glue gel so what happened I noticed that it catching on my hair when I do my shampoo and it's catch so many times throughout the week because I wash my hair every the other day and every time it, it's it's catching in between of my bows and my hair will pull one of my crystal off this one it doesn't do a thing this one it doesn't do anything but i want to leave it there so then i can show i can be a real testimony the the condensed glue gel is hold all the crystal really great but because my hair pulled i have a long hair and when i shampoo where i go my th fingers go to between my hair and it keep catching it and then i know that it's gonna pull it because i have to get it off so i pull I pull, I using, um, go to my head and I pull it off. And then that's why today, even like today, I showed Mika too. So Mika, Mika, look at it, how I abuse this one. Well, it's not abuse because it doesn't, it's have all the edges, the gap that I didn't seal in because I want to leave it here so I can show you. Um, all the big swan is still on, but then because the hair will really knock it and pull it so hard out. But then all the little ones that, it's really stay on good with the condensed glue gels and with the uh, no wipe top coat but the big one is great to have the precision even the spinning it stay there it doesn't do anything and then the flowers everything else is stay but whatever that is was catching on the hair what is gonna make just imagine it for it for yourself or for your clients they go oh my god it's so cute so gorgeous but it's getting to my hair. this one doesn't do it to my hair it doesn't pull my hairs or stuck in my hair at all but this one does because it's some of those edges that is not sealed in 
So just for your preference, that is that's why if this baby is coming, it will triple secure, double secure, and triple secure, and we're gonna go to all the edges. That's this one is catching my hair right here. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give you a little bit of the um the uh check like do a little exam you feel right here you can feel it like scratchy when you do it for yourself or your clients you can notice that right away that is gonna be scratchy and this gonna pull your hair or if you get stuck in your sweater the sweat sweater season is gonna get stuck and it's gonna pull your crystal um off from your nails eventually so i'm gonna seal it on the top of the beads but not on the top of the crystal you don't want to destroy all your sparkles or shy in the cut of the crystal and then we keep for 60 seconds just in case this one i have to seal a few time because it's get more a lot of like elements in there so i make sure that i seal that a couple more time but each time you seal you can definitely seal more than you need i mean more time as you need uh make sure this flash key for like 30 seconds first and then you can seal again so i'm go ahead and doing it around i'm only checking around the base of the crystal or base of the crystals and then you are going to cure normally i get bored of my hands i cure but this time i'm like i want to show you how i doing it um with without um showing you in here that i did it this hand all on live and i didn't seal this one but they are stay on good but because the hairs will pull it off a lot after so many wash on my hair that's it's great to know i just want to show you so this one but you can't tell it but it's just nice that it have a triple secure so this is if you're having your like troubleshoot if your clients having like that issue like catching on the hair even though they love it so much and they keep catching on the hair this is condensable gels hold it down the top coat will seal completely um around the base of the crystals and also is will not like when you finish just no tacky layer and this is a triple secure school keep all your crystal will stay nice in one place last set actually i really like hit my nails more than like it's come my nails will probably gonna get damaged more than it's just the crystal so that is the um crystal trifecta we have condensed glue gel no wipe top coat precision glue gel and then your extra of the crystals uh mega mix so this is you know i would highly highly recommend this because this is going to keep all your crystal and stay in one and then this this one, the ones I do a lot of work. You think that this right hand, but I do a lot of work on my left hand. So here is the final look for this two now. It's just really cute and simple. I'm going to wipe off the residues on my um, crystal first. Just a second so you can see how cute it is. Even though it's obsidian and it's so gorgeous. It feel like it's black and white holidays, you know, theme. I can't wait to see your beautiful creations and so many, many of designs that I can't wait to share with you in the next coming video. You can definitely grab this box, whether you get it for yourself or you can able to sub for your bestie and absolutely sub with your confidence because you can cancel it anytime. A great gift to send it to your friend, your sister, your mom, your um, siblings, your bestie, your significant others whoever loved ones in your life that you want to send a special gift for the holiday it doesn't have to be it's just holiday you can sub all year round for you know the person you want to a lot of husbands sub for their wife i think it's such a great great gift for just because you know great support so thank you dom and I'm here admiring all of your works too with Dom, Mika. They are so trendy. We have Brazil's at Bellis Nails. We have Mika, Mika Do Nails, Dom Simply Nail Eden. And is Dom having is uh giving away on her page right now as well. So it's really cool. And we have Vicky, Vicky Jensen, our lead educator, and we have Isabel at Skillmatics Nails. So so excited. Ah, Mama Vic, thank you. Love the sub box. Me too. I can't wait to see your sub box. See what is you are going to get. You might have the colors that I want. 
<laughs> I want everything. <laughs> Thank you, Mika. Oh, Mika. Mika is one of our really talented DAS. Wow, she's right here next to me. Working so hard. Mika, as Mika do nails. And stay tuned for a lot of content they are as Glispia is going to create as well. What uh, mega mixed crystal set would you? Okay, okay, hold on. Can you get me the comment? I couldn't see it for far away. The mega, the crystal? Yep, that mega mix crystal set would look so bomb with that Christmas. Form. Yes, I agree. I absolutely agree. What is this? Yeah. Yeah, awesome. Mochi nails. Did I say it right? Thank you, Mochi. All right. So I hope you really enjoying it today. I'm just so thrilled about this baby nude velvety gel you have to experience it yourself that how simple easy whether you do it for yourself or your clients it's great for beginners now take it great for even the um really a long time experience and they'll take the one to take the business to another level and uh on the menu add it on the menu and there's one thing about this less filing and also is light easy to shape and to filing and then this like easy application when the client's wing is so lightweight and easy to remove it as well and it's flexible and also it's a great thing is this less really really super less odor so you don't smell nothing pretty much at all and uh, the great thing about it, it does salt level for you so you don't have to work crazy crazy hard uh, which is we always work hard but it's great that the product is still flows it for us so then that way what well, if you are is like you know uh, placing your beats on and you don't have to worry about oh my gosh my god my beats is setting so this is definitely going to be a great uh it's kind of a step stone for if we are doing with the liquid and powder and building a liquid and powder skills as well as building a clientele it's going to be a great way to take your skill to the next level i am so excited and i appreciate every single of you for tuning in with me every single day and we keep going because of a lot of people are amazing like you out there and thanks so much for amazing love and support um don't forget to check out the subscription boxes if you want to get the box right on the beginning of a cycle this is a great time to sub now it's gonna flying right to your door in like two days so you get everything on your station your desk to get start playing and create a really cute fun set for the holidays if you are doing like Beside the clients you are doing is a press on at another additional business is going to be a great a lot of nail arts for you to come up with a great nice beautiful set of nails as well. So thank you so much for everyone there's a lot of is activity going on we are having the uh official grand openings this weekend in pensacola florida if you are is, is around or you are making a trip to uh, pensacola i would love to see your beautiful faces and we're excited to see you with a lot of demos going on this weekend and a free gift as well and a special of the is countdown sales going on online as well as in the store uh too and also the class is going on on a both is hands-on in-person class and also is online a virtual class is up on the website so you can check them out if you have any question don't hesitate to dm us if you have like what is bundles come with this when you sign up the class so then we're able to is able to send you a more details there's a lot of detail on the website but if you would like to is um contact us you can definitely dm us or email us at info at .com. thanks so much everyone for the amazing day and happy friday and hope you have a fabulous productive day and i was definitely looking forward to see you in the next live videos bye everyone